Namaste, hi, and welcome to the ninth and final day of our Pranayama course. Today, as I mentioned already, we'll practice another full sequence of Pranayama exercises. Again, we will begin with the Nadi Shodana combined with the Ujjayi. Then the middle part will be different. Today, as the energizing part of the practice, we will do the Bastrika Pranayama. I hope you remember, it's the very powerful Pranayama where we inhale, lifting the arms and then very forcefully through the nose, exhale, and then again, inhale through the nose. After this, what we want to do after the last stroke of Bastrika, we inhale through the right nostril, we hold the breath inside as long as humanly possible. And once you can't hold the breath any longer, you exhale left, you recover for a moment, and then we apply the root lock, the mula bandha, contracting of the pelvic floor. And then we apply the, the drishti, the brumika drishti looking between the eyebrows. And then we close the eyes and then we'll finish again with the Pranak Kriya. You don't have to memorize it. Luckily, we have the video format and I'll guide you through it. So please sit comfortable and close your eyes and begin to take a few yogic breaths We're expanding the breath. We're becoming aware of the breath. And then we want to practice Bastrika Pranayama for about 20 strokes. So bring your arms out to the side. And then with a deep inhale through the nose, lift the hands. And very forceful exhale through the nose. Last one. Now inhale through the right. And then close your nose and hold the breath as long as you can. When you can't hold any longer, exhale with control through the left nostril and come back to a natural and normal breath. Observe the effect of the pranayama and then apply mula bandha, means contract your pelvic floor. Slightly open the eyes, look at the tip of your nose first and slide the gaze up, look between your eyebrow center. Now 
Hold the Mula Banda. Hold the guys. Full focus. And release. Close the eyes. Look within. And again, let's finish the sequence with nine rounds of Prana of Kriya. That means Ujjayi inhalation, the awareness rises from the pelvic floor to the space between the eyebrows. And exhale with an Om. Feel the vibration in the head. And then move the awareness with the vibration down back to the pelvic floor. Let's begin together. Take a deep inhale. Full exhale. And begin Ujjayi inhalation. Raise the awareness. Oh. And the last time. Um. And contract the pelvic floor. Apply the Mula Banda. And release. Observe yourself for a while.
Wonderful. All right. So that's it. That was the ninth day. Thank you for being here. And as I mentioned, please continue to repeat the eighth and ninth video until you understand the practice. I'll also attach a PDF where you find the sequences in a written form so you can practice on your own. And eventually I would invite you to memorize the practice so you can just do it on your own freely without having to listen to anybody, without having to look at anything. And then you can also play around with it, of course. You can extend the length a lot if you want. Of all the exercises, you can do them longer or you can do several rounds of, the, of each building block. And then I would be really happy to hear about how the experience was for you. So please write a private message or write a comment. Let me know the effect that the pranayama had on you. And last, but certainly not least, I want to say thank you and pay my respect to Ashutosh from the Swami Krishnananda Yogshala in Mysore, who taught me all of this. And I'm very grateful I received these exercises. And I'm happy to have them within my repertoire to apply them for myself and to be able to share them with you. And very grateful. I feel very fortunate for this. And I want to thank each and every one of you who is part of the journey, who is doing the practice, who is being a force of good in the world. I do sincerely appreciate this. Namaste. Thank mm -hmm. you.